Hi. I'd like to quickly show you some of the cool things that the final word can do for you. But first, a little bit of background. We all know what SEO is and what its value is for your blog. It's an old game and it's sort of played like this. First, you create a page, then you edit it the way you want. If you're using some sort of SEO plugin, you, you use that or some analytics tool to tell you if your content is good to go. You publish it and you cross your fingers. Okay, so what's the problem with this? Well, you're basically having to compromise your original idea just so that a bunch of machines can decide if people will find your page or not. We thought that was a bit silly. After all, you do own your own content, right? So we came up with the final word. What is the final word? Well, on the surface, it's a really simple tool that allows you to do a couple of things. One, it helps you answer, what do the machines think my content is about? So here I've got a little bit of text that I wrote about my iPad 3. I'm, I'm just going to tell it to, uh, to suggest some topics, some keywords for us. And it returns back pretty much what I would have expected. And these topics and the keywords correlate with the text that I've provided. I can just keep selecting them if I want. In this case, I've got now a primary keyword of iPad. Now, if I come up over here again and do suggest keywords, what it's going to do is it's going to pull in a whole bunch of extra stuff from us. So if I provide my own keyword, or if I use one of the ones that it suggests, it, it goes out and does a whole bunch of extra little things for us. This includes things like other keywords, uh, content, images, related links, all of the little things, the ingredients that we need in order to supplement our original text. Again, we would typically keep adding things to our normal page in order, and let's say, and use some sort of SEO plugin to fix it until it's optimized. With the final word, those steps are a thing of the past. We get everything that we need right here. The third thing that it does is it evaluates our content for us. Now, I know this is a little bit of, um, how should I say, uh, overdone in the WordPress scene, but we really needed to throw it in in order that you get your real-time uh, analysis. So if I evaluate the content that it's pulled back for me for the machines, you'll see here that the keyword analysis returns, well, everything's green. It's all perfect. There's, there's a few things we can't do, for example, like uh, we can't now, we can just give you a, rank, uh, a rating of your permalink or your title. Those things are outside the scope of the content, so you'll, you'll really need to fix those yourself. But if I go back here to my human text and run the evaluation again, you'll see that it fails miserably. Well, that's no problem because the final word is going to guarantee that when a search engine comes in, it gets this content. Now, what you'll see here is I've provided some content here. So uh, I've got the content about the iPad 3. If I run back to my machines, you'll see that the, the content is also there too. Now, I can come here and I can change that. I can change this text if I want. iPad 3 makes me happy. And uh, let's just save the draft and have a look and see what comes out of it. You know, if uh, iPad 3 makes me happy, it's still there. It's, not, it's a heading too, but okay. Nevertheless, you'll see that I, I can keep changing the content. I can tweak the content that it has automatically generated for me for the machines, or I can just leave the one that it's in, that that's uh, that it provides for me. The thing is that SEO isn't what it used to be. You can no longer just sit back and hope that your page will be found just because some plugin said that it was okay. You need the intelligence at your fingertips to figure out how search engines understand your content. Here, I'll just pick a little bit of text here. Um, Pick some other text and run the optimizer again on it. Suggest keywords based on that text. And I get back a whole other set of information. I have real-time information here that, that helps me target my audience. That real-time intelligence is built into the final word, and we are confident that it will help you on your SEO journey from today forward. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to contact us at us at d2mark.com or via our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash d2mark. Thanks.